My Olympus OMD EM1 Mark II can capture images with around about 20 million pixels. Now that's more than enough to make really big prints that are viewed very close with excellent quality. But if you need fine detail, check out the high res mode, which can give you images with 25 million, 50 million, maybe even 80 million pixels, all with just one press of the shutter. So how does your Olympus camera do this? Well, it's a combination of multiple exposures and tiny precise movements of the camera sensor. Each high res image is in fact eight individual pictures and between each shot, the sensor is moved a tiny amount. Then the camera combines the images together and bingo, you get a high res shot. To activate high res mode and set it up, press the menu button on the back of your camera and then go down to shooting menu number two. Go across and down to high res shot. Go across again to the high res shot menu, across once more and then down to zero seconds. Zero seconds means that you'll take your high res shot as soon as you press the shutter, but that does mean there is a slight chance of camera shake. To get around this, go across from zero seconds and then press the up button to scroll through all the different shutter delay times. When you find one that suits your shooting style, press OK to set the delay. Then press OK again to turn on high res shot. Now press the menu button a few times and you'll exit out of the menus. So that's it, you're ready to take your high res pictures, but there is one more thing you might want to look at. Now to find it, I'm gonna press the OK button to bring up the live super control panel. Go to the file type and press OK, and you'll find there are four choices. There's two JPEGs and two JPEG and RAWs. Now both have a 50 million pixel and a 25 million pixel option, but in fact the RAW file actually contains 80 million pixels. And you'll also record a standard pixel count RAW file that you can open with Olympus software. Because high res mode takes multiple images, you really do need a sturdy platform like a tripod and you need to shoot something that's fairly static. So a still life or a landscape is the perfect subject. However, if you need the ultimate in high resolution images, high res mode is the perfect tool for the job. I'm Gavin Hoey, thanks for watching.